Y'all, I am so excited. Welcome to our happy hour. There is four of us hey. and coaches on here and music is going again. Y'all, you know, we're not professional. We're just kind of trying to figure this out. I told you this is going to be something really laid back, really chilled, just something for us to be able to come share our hearts with you and share why coaching has changed our life and see if it could be for you. So first I wanted to welcome you. Um, we will be sharing, you'll be hearing from three other coaches, so four including myself. Um, we're going to be sharing our stories. We will be sharing what we do as coaches, so you'll be able to kind of see what we do, what a day in the life of us looks like, because I promise you none of our days look the exact same. Um, we're also going to be talking about all the limiting beliefs that we had about this gig and kind of how we combated those limiting beliefs. Um, and then you're even going to hear about income, how we make money, trips and incentives. Um, and then lastly, how we, how, how to sign up and get started with us. So I'm going to go ahead and start sharing my story. If you guys don't know me, my name is Ali Griffith. I have been a coach for two and a half years almost. Um, I am a new mama, so I have a four-year-old and I have a four-week-old. And life is crazy, life is insane, but we wouldn't have any other way. So how I found out about coaching was pretty unconventional. Um, I start, I've always struggled with my weight. I have always, you know, yo-yo diet. I've always gone up and down and binge eating and emotional eating, and I've never been able to stay consistent in my, in my diet or nutrition. Um, I've tried everything under the sun and nothing worked. And then I would go to the gym, but I never really knew what to do. Like anybody else go to the gym and you literally are like confined to the treadmill and then the elliptical. And that is it because you do not want to go to the scary weights where the big muscle heads are because they will look at you like you are batch and crazy. Am I right? So I would always just stay on the treadmill, then the elliptical, and I never really saw any results. Um, and so I never really stayed consistent because I never had a plan. I had my daughter, um, lost my mom in the midst of that. And so I, then I had my daughter and I was like, I've got to get healthy, right? Because I don't want my daughter to lose me at a young age. And so I signed up for Beachbody because I was just scrolling on social media and I came across my coach and I was like, she was so full of life. She was so just everything. She loved herself no matter what. And I was like, I don't know what crack this woman's smoking, but like, I want it because I want to feel that way. So I signed up. Um, but I refused to coach because I had a full-time job. I was working 10 plus hours a day, literally couldn't imagine coaching. Um, and I just, I was 300 pounds myself. I wasn't going to coach. And then I canceled the shakes right away because mm, no, not for me either. I basically was going to do this my way and that was, and that was it. And I did that for an entire year and then got nowhere. Um, I kind of yo-yoed back and forth with it and really got nowhere. And then I was like, you know what? I've got to make a commitment. And one year later, I found myself in the floor of the old Navy dressing room crying because I felt broken. I felt like I was never going to be able to lose the weight, that nothing worked, and I was going to go get weight loss surgery. And then one of my friends was like, Allie, you just got to commit. You've got to commit to the nutrition. You've got to commit to the workouts. You've got to go all in. And I was like, yeah, that's easier for you to say. Like, that, I, I don't know how to do that. And she's like, we'll hold each other accountable and do it. And so I recommitted to Beachbody um, with a program called 80 Day. And if you guys follow me. That's the program I'm about to do again. And I'm literally so excited. Um, but I committed to the program 80 day obsession as a customer, because again, I was not going to coach. I was over 300 pounds and I didn't believe in myself. It's like, who would want to listen to somebody that is obese, morbidly obese, who would want to be coached and trained by somebody that's that way? because they can't obviously help themselves. So how are they supposed to help you? Am I right? And so that was like my biggest limiting belief that nobody wanted to listen to me because of how big I was. And you know, that's honestly the exact opposite. It gave them somebody to relate to. It gave him somebody to aspire to. It gave him, if Ali can do it, why can't I? 
And that's been my biggest, I guess, something that's really helped me along on this journey is I've been able to take people from kind of very, very obese and hates myself and depressed and suicidal to, you know, full of life and still overweight, but doesn't give an F and still loves life and is getting results. And so, you know, I decided, I was like, all right, I'm going to, I'm going to give this coaching thing a try because hello, you get a discount on your products. And I needed that discount because things are expensive and I was broke. Um, and so I just kind of slowly tiptoed into coaching and then I helped my first few people and I was like, Oh, this is cool. I'm getting paid to just like post on social media and help people. I was like, Oh, this is fun. Like, but I'm not really going to do anything with it. And then I got my first success story. The first person who said, Allie, thank you so much for completely changing my life. And I was like, okay, I'm sold. This is the best thing ever. Like I'm literally, it's my job to make women feel empowered, make women feel amazing. And then I get to help myself in the process because literally this is the only thing that keeps me consistent because I couldn't keep myself consistent, but it, it's, it's magic. And so I was like, all right, well, now I really want to retire myself. Like I really want to bring myself home because selling insurance does not make me feel this badass. Like it just didn't, it didn't make me feel this good and fulfilled and, and in love. So I reached out to my coach and I was like, so how many lives will I have to change to be able to retire myself? And at this time, I mean, I wasn't making much. I was making $30,000 a year. And she, she told me, this is how many people, and this is, you know, what you would have to do. And I was like, okay, I don't know how I'm going to do that, but I'm going to figure it out. And so I just started reaching out to as many people as possible. And I started sharing as much as I could. And, and we will train you on all this and teach you, you know, a lot of us had to learn the hard way, Dr. Google, you know, YouTube, we had to learn all that the hard way. But the best thing is you've got four, you're going to have four coaches that are just like obsessed with helping our downline. So, um, I Googled all that. And then, you know, I started helping more people. And within three months, I was able to retire myself and bring myself home. And of course, you know, we don't guarantee anything, right? It's only based on your hard work and how much you show up and the commitment you're willing to make. But within three months, I was able to retire myself. And now I've been a full-time stay-at-home, you know, mom and business owner for two years, um, just over two years. And so it's been the biggest blessing in my life because now I'm getting to share these moments with my daughter, right? And I'm getting to hold my newborn and not have to go pump because, you know, I keep thinking, you know, I'm five weeks postpartum. Next week would have been how, when I would have had to go back to work. And I literally can cry thinking about that because with my daughter, with Riley, that was what I had to do. I had to go back. We couldn't survive off of one income. And now because of this business, because of the opportunity that this has been, because of my hard work and because of my team that I've been able to stay at home. And so I'm not going to have to miss those moments. And I get to sit there and hold my daughter and say, I'm not going to have to miss any of this because I know how quickly they grow up. And so it's been the biggest blessing ever in my entire life. Um, and I know that this opportunity has blessed the other coaches that we'll be sharing, um, just as much as it's helped me. And so I'm going to go ahead and send it over to Liz and she is going to share her story and how this has helped her. Okay. Am I unmuted? Can we all? Okay. I think I'm good. Right? Yes. Okay. Hi, how is everybody tonight? All right, I am Liz. For those who don't know me, I am a wife, a bonus mom, a mom of two little girls, and a mom of two puppies, possibly a third on the way. Fingers crossed. We will see. We're a little crazy. I came into Beachbody, oh gosh, um, my daughter's going to be five, so four years ago now. Um, 
I was, like Ali just said, a gym goer, but I was very focused on the treadmill and the elliptical. Um, maybe if I got crazy, I headed over to the bike, but I did not know what to do. I was frustrated because I was a breastfeeding mom, so I didn't think I could lose the weight. And I was frustrated because it wasn't just naturally coming off like it did for Kim Kai. And that wasn't fair. But it was easy for her. She had a nutritionist. She had a personal trainer. I didn't have any of those. And little did I know that I could have all of that in my pocket. Um, so I was complaining to one of my girlfriends about this. She told me about one of our programs called the 21 day fix. Very similar to Ali's story. I kind of did it, kind of didn't, um, and still lost weight doing it. So I was like, all right, there's something to this. Um, fast forward over the summer, my sister messaged me and was like, Hey, we actually, um, have these kids now. And you know how we have that dad who passed away of cancer when we were kids. I was like, Yeah. She's like, we should probably go see what our chances are of that. I was like, all right, I guess we should. So we go one vial of blood later, one FedEx overnight shipment later, the results come back. Um, and we find out that I have a higher predisposition of getting certain cancers. I don't have the BRCA gene. I didn't need to get a double mastectomy, even though it looks like I did. Um, oh, that's just nursing two kids. Um, all that it means is that I have to be more cognizant of my health. So I really was able to take a step back and I was like, I have all of these tools and these resources in, in my pocket. I have all of these recipes that enable me to eat clean. I have all of these workouts that I can do while my daughter naps. I have all of these things. I'm just sitting on them. And this was kind of like the kick in the butt that I needed to take it to the next level. So I did. I did one of our, another one of our three-week programs, 30 minutes a day, did my workouts while my daughter napped. Um, was never going to coach because I didn't want to post my workouts. I didn't want to post my body. I didn't want to post any of that on social media. If you follow me now, you can see the ironic, the irony, that's the word, the irony in that statement, because now I'm like, here it is. This is me. Um, but back then I did not want any parts of that. So I'm doing my thing, I'm getting my results, I share it in our accountability group, which when you join us, you will be in whoever invited you to this call, we all run our own groups and we will add you into those as well to help you start your journey. But I shared my results in there and um, my coach at the time was like, oh my God, Liz, like you need to share this. And I go, that's a, that's a good joke, girl. I, no chance, I hide people that share this stuff. And she was like, but what if you could help one person feel the way that you feel now? And I said, well, shit, <laughs> like, that's not fair. So what I did was I took my pictures, I put them side by side. She gave me this app and told me how, and I, which we will do the same thing in your trainings. Um, when, and I put it up on Facebook cause Instagram wasn't really a thing back then. And I put my phone face down on the table and I walked away. I was like, I don't want to see, hear, do anything. When I finally got the courage to look at it, it was one of the most commented and liked pictures mm -hmm. I had. My friends, my family, people from high school that I hadn't talked to in years wanted to know what I did. They wanted to know more about what I was doing. Um, so that's really when my business was born. Um, I just, I committed to programs from there on, there on out because I knew what the commitment could do. Um, and I just started, you know, building my business every day. I would work out with my daughter in naps. I would um, do my, you know, business building activities at night after she went to sleep. And I was able to build a really awesome team and able to build a little bit of independence and get some income of my own. Um, because before this, I was a stay-at-home mom. And when you lose your dad to cancer at 19 and your mom, who was a stay-at-home mom, all of a sudden has to go through paying the bills and paying the mortgage and finds out she has second mortgages taken out on her house. And there is no rainy day fund. And the first thing she did was pay off her mortgage and pay my college tuition. And anything left over, she had to ration and deal with. And this was like that, like, yeah, he had cancer. It wasn't like, you know, he passed away in a tragic car accident or anything like that, but 
it, it still happens very quickly when you lose somebody you love. So she's not only grieving her husband, but she's now managing a household and, um, and a household like income. And I swore to myself that that was never going to be me. And then when I was, was a stay at home mom, I saw myself heading down that path and it scared the living daylights out of me. I did not want to fully rely on somebody for my own worth. And that's what this opportunity has taught me. It has taught me so much about myself. It has taught me about relationships. It's made me a better wife, a better mom. Like when I tell you that I battle anxiety, like I've been to ther therapy, I had postpartum anxiety with my second. Um, this has helped me so much with that. It's helped me just be a better person. So it's so much more than workouts. It's so much more than, you know, good nutrition. But when you focus on yourself for that period of time, whether it's 20 minutes, 30 minutes a day, you'll find how much it filters into the other areas of your life. So um, that was, you know, really where, where I started. And um, yeah, now I'm here and I'm so excited to see so many awesome faces here tonight and just really share everything with you guys. So um, with that, I will throw it over to Melissa and let her share a little bit of her story. Ali, I don't think I can actually toss it over to her because <laughs> I'm not the host. Oh, you, you mean it's my turn to do something? Yeah, I just want to make sure you're still awake over there because you have a four-week-old, so <laughs> I know that life. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I am Melissa McQueenie. I am a mom of three kids. I have a teenager, 15-year-old girl, an 11-year-old son, and a 7-year-old daughter. I I'm a therapist as well as a coach, and I've been a coach for four years. And I'm so excited to share my story. These ladies got me all hyped up because we all have our own unique stories of what brought us here, but we all love it so freaking much. So what brought me to coaching was I fell in love with running first. Running, I fell in love with in 2014 or 2013. And the minute I started running, I just fell in love with being active. I had never been active before then. I was a lifelong long smoker, sedentary, didn't know how to eat properly. Um, and when I started running, you know, if anyone's a runner here, you kind of know that runners have this mentality. You run all the miles, you eat all the food. And <laughs> I fell in love with 5Ks, then 10Ks, half marathons, and when I was training for my first marathon, I gained about 20 pounds. And I thought, this is crazy. This is the most active I've ever been in my whole entire life. How am I gaining weight? But like I said, I was running all the miles, eating all the food and not doing anything else. On the days that you know a running training plan would say strength training, I would just run some more because why would I need anything else? So during this time, I saw my coach posting on social media, you know, so much inspiration. She was traveling, you know, she was just so positive. She was always posting about her workouts. And I watched from afar, really, really scared to jump in. I was scared to kind of revamp my whole life. I was scared to add fitness and change up my nutrition. But finally, I said, enough is enough. I need to do something. Um, I need to, and it was all about running. All of my goals were about running. I wanted to be a better runner, a faster runner. So that was why I ultimately signed up because it would positively affect my running, I hoped. And um, so very cliche, I joined on New Year's Day and um, the rest is history. I started with 21 Day Fix and I followed the nutrition and the workouts to a T and I loved the results. I lost seven pounds. I was a fast runner. I saw my running times decrease. And as I said, that was all that really mattered to me at the time. And it was really fun. It was really fun to, to share what I was doing. People were asking me. And my biggest objection when I started was that I was, didn't want to be salesy to people. I didn't want to come across as somebody who wanted to make money off of people. And that was really in my head. That was really where I was at. I joined uh, as a coach, like Ali said, to get the discount. 
I wanted this to be a long-term um, solution for me. I didn't want it to be a you know 21 day thing or a month long thing. I wanted this long term. I wanted my family to be you know positively impacted. So that was why I signed up. And but what I found through this process was the same thing as like if you love the restaurant down the street, you share it with the people that you love. And I loved this. I loved the workouts. I eventually when I started going to live events, we you know, when things are not happening in the world like they are now, we get together, you know, quarterly events. We have a, um, our annual conference every summer. And when you go to those live events, you see what the community is like, the energy, the enthusiasm, the passion, the, the encouragement um, of all the people. We all just are so into encouraging each other and growing. And it's just the best thing ever. And when I started going to live events, I didn't even know anybody, but you meet them there. You meet people. When I went to Summit, our annual conference for the first time in July, you know, I knew nobody. And on the plane, at, when I would go to my connecting flight, you know, there's fellow coaches and we're all talking and we're all hanging out. We don't even know each other, but we all just share this love of this life. And it's just done so much for me. And one of the biggest things, and I don't know if it's because of my therapy, world that I love so much too, but the mindset piece. We're all about the nutrition. We're all about the fitness, but we're also all about the personal development and growing and learning and always go, getting better. And like um, Liz said, this has touched every aspect of my life, not just my health. It's touched the health of my children and my family too. But it's also like, I can't even tell you what it's done for my marriage because of this mindset shift of me controlling what I can control, being grateful for everything that my husband is and my husband does. It's just changed everything in my life. And I, like Liz said, I'm a better mom. I'm a better friend. I'm just a better person because of what this, this has done for me. And it's now this passion of mine to, to, pass this on to other people because everybody deserves to feel this good. Everybody deserves to feel this passionate about their life. I mean, I wake up at 5 a.m. every day because I cannot wait to start my day. I never felt like that before. I was always sleeping till a kid woke me up. Now I want to get my feet on the ground and get to work to change other people's lives the way that mine's been changed. So we're so happy to have you here and hope that you join us. And I will pass it to Megan. Hey, you guys. I am Megan Hunt. Um, I have been a coach for three years. Um, and my journey kind of started a little bit differently. I was a new mom of two. Um, I had just moved back to Seattle um, from Arizona, switched career paths, and started working for my dad in finance. Um, I had taught previously, so it was a massive career change. Um, and I kind of, in that move and that transition, really lost myself. Um, I had my second child, and I found myself in just a mix of postpartum depression and anxiety and hiding it from everyone because I did not understand what was going on and I didn't want to admit that I had a problem. So I was um, six, months, six months postpartum. I was up late at night feeding my little guy and flipping through the channels, of course, an infomercial came on and it was for a beach body program, hip hop, or um, I'm sorry, not hip hop. It was a hip hop program called Size um, with Sean T. I had never done any fitness classes or anything. I hated fitness because gyms gave me a huge anxiety attack. Um, and so I just saw how happy these people were on the infomercial, they were having fun, they were sweating, the workouts were only like 30 minutes, and I was like, if I, if these people can all do it, I think I can too, so I ordered it, um, honestly not thinking that I would have time, not thinking that I would even do it, but every single day I started showing up because it was so much fun. I had no idea about the coaching opportunity. I didn't even know that there was like accountability groups that you could jump into. I knew none of that. I just was doing this by myself. Um, 
and I would actually video myself dancing, which is so funny because I am the worst <laughs> dancer ever. Um, and back then that was a huge deal. Now I might, I might dance in front of people, but back then, no way. Um, but I just was loving how it was making me feel. So I continue showing up. I, um, lost weight. I was 50 pounds overweight. So, um, I was losing the weight. People were starting to notice. I was feeling amazing. I had so much more energy. Um, and so I bought another program because back then it was the DVDs, you know? And so I then did Pio and then Hammer and Chisel. And again, had no clue <laughs> that there was coaching. I must not have watched the end of those, those DVDs to figure out that there was something bigger than just the fitness programs. But, um, I was loving them. People were noticing my weight loss. I was sharing it with anybody that would listen to me and telling them they had to go get these DVDs because they were changing my life. Um, and then about a year after I started seeing a girl on social media who I actually went to junior high with and we had lost, lost touch um, after, after junior high. But I saw her showing up, saw her talking about these workouts, did not know that they were the same thing I was doing, um, but saw her showing up, saw her talking. She was a single mom also of two kids. So saw her showing up with her kids there, talking about how she was making an income from home. Um, and I started researching on my own, would not contact her because I did not want to like look like a, you know, a creep. So I would research on my own, what is she doing? And I finally figured out that she was doing the exact same programs that I was. So, um, one day she had made a post about being able to retire herself from her counseling position as a single mom of two kids. You guys, I had no idea that I even wanted to stay home with my kids, but I knew that if she could do something like that, there was something more that I could do. Um, and I reached out to her. So I was <laughs> the, the one person probably who like actually reached out to their coach asking what they were doing. Um, she told me all about it. I signed up the next day and I have not looked back. The programs have changed my life. Um, I honestly though, when I first started this, I was working full time. I was going to school to further my career in finance. I was a mom of two kids, two little ones. I was running my three-year-old all over the place to her gymnastics classes and daycare and everything. Um, I did not think I would have any time to run this business. And I found that I could in small pockets throughout the day. And that's what I did. And that's what I've done for the past three years. Um, just working in small chunks, whatever is convenient for me. I'll sit down, pop on for 10 minutes, go be present with my kids, hop on for another 15 minutes whenever I can. Um, and this now has brought me home. Um, I still do work outside of the house part-time, um, but it has brought me down to part-time hours. And um, I know it will eventually bring me home to my kids if that is what I truly do want to do, um, which it is, but uh, it's just opened up so many new opportunities for me and it's been an incredible journey. Um, so I think I'm passing it back on to Allie. Ah, I'm back. Did y'all miss me? Uh, so. I am just, I always get so freaking fired up when I hear other people's stories because the insane thing is, is, you know, this business, I feel like so much in like corporate American stuff, right? You get the raise based on, you know, the education you have and how much money you have, or, you know, your looks or whatever the case may be, but this business is not biased, right? Every single one of us are completely different. I mean, I and a high school graduate college dropout like i went for one semester and said no nope, not for me deuces there's you know prof like there's just so many different people that are so successful and you know it's just so inspiring to me but i also wanted to talk about some of the limiting beliefs that a lot of us had and i know you know megan just talked about time and i think that's a huge one because i know for me i was working 10 hour days and it was just insane but i also want to talk about the introverts, right? Because I know a ton of us, I am like the extroverted, introverted person you'll ever meet. I don't even know if I said that right, but it, it is. 
but there are tons of t successful introverts and I know a few of them are. So I wanted, you know, one of our trusty introverts over here to maybe talk about that for a minute because I know that's a big limiting belief that I might not be the best person to talk about it, but one of them might be. So which one of y'all? Raise your hand real quick. Melissa, Megan, Liz. Any of you guys want to talk about it? Megan will go for it. I am the... <laughs> I am so shy and like literally you put me in a room with people and I'm the one in the corner. Um, it takes me a long time to like warm up to people, but honestly, I have so much fun actually reaching out to people and making connections because it's all online. Like I'm not actually getting on the phone with, I mean, sometimes I do, but I'm not actually like face to face. I feel like I can be myself without having to... Um, you know, worry like, oh my gosh, what are they going to say about me or what, you know, how are, how are they um, perceiving me and like all of those things. So it's just really nice, I think, to, I don't know, it, it, this business is for everyone. <laughs> it really is. It's for introverts, extroverts, all of, all of the above. So if anyone else add to that. I can add to that a little bit. Um, so I, I guess I'm kind of like Allie, like I'm an introverted extrovert, extroverted introvert, however you want to say it, but I do have a lot of coaches on my team who are introverts. And what I always tell them is, and what they found too, is that they can be successful at this because if you're an introvert at the end of the day, you're talking to people from your phone, you're talking to people from a screen. So, and that's also too, where, um, we talked a little bit about the mindset, but you know, working, cause I get up every morning, um, I'm up at 5 AM and I'm reading a book and that book is based off of things that will better me. Um, right now I'm reading rising strong by Brene Brown and she's all about owning your story and owning the things that you went through in your life. So the point is that when you know what you have to work on, so maybe you can work on, you know, communicating or stepping a little bit outside of your comfort zone, not saying you have to be like, Bah! all of the time like we want you to be you but um you still are able to reach people and help people and think of all the other introverts that you know that want to do something like this but won't because they're too shy like that is exactly why you'd be able to help so many people so just my little two cents <laughs> yes i love that and i think so many of us like kind of let that you know, the self-sabotage go kind of keep us from going like, oh, well, you know, I might be too overweight for this, or I don't have a social media following. I can promise you every single one of us had zero social media following. If I had maybe 200 followers and y'all, I am millennial as it gets, right? I'm only 25. I was 23, 22 when I started this. I didn't even know what a DM was. So if you know what a direct message is, you're already miles ahead of where I was when I started this. I was at like Tequila Tuesday with one of my friends and she was like, Ali, you have like five DMs. I was like, what is a DM? She's like messages on Instagram. I was like, you can do that? Like, I didn't even know you could do that. So, you know, a lot of us think, well, we have to have this crazy social media following or know all these things about social media. And that's the best thing about joining one of us is we are all very successful coaches and we all, you know, have trainings that we take you through and we do one-on-one -on -one mentorships. So you don't have to know all that stuff. We almost don't like you to know all that stuff because we get to show you the right way to do things and the right way to grow things and, and how not to be salesy because y'all, there is nothing worse than feeling like super icky and salesy and sliding into people's DMs and like, you know, that it works people and like, do you want to buy a wrap? Like, no, we don't want anyone who's salesy. We don't want anybody that, you know, just is okay with like selling people things because that's not what we're about. We're about sharing our journey and sharing what works for us. There's one thing that every single one of our stories had in common, and that is that these programs have changed our lives, and that is why we're sharing. And, you know, it might have changed our lives as we were sharing about it, right? It didn't happen right at the get-go, but we were sharing what we were using, and that means we're sharing our journey. And so I wanted to go ahead and share my screen real – oh, Liz, wanted to share something. <laughs> Nothing like throwing it over to me. <laughs> oh, no I pressure. You Liz yourself. wanted to share something. That's I amazing. You muted yourself. I didn't. 
Well, yeah. there's our technical difficulty for the day. So we're just going to go ahead and roll with it. But I want to go ahead and share my screen. I want to share, you know, how we make money and some of the really fun and cool perks that comes with, you know, being a coach and, and joining and, and doing the thing with us. So we're, here we are. So income progressions, I don't like to get too into the money because of course, it's not about the money. The money, yes, it's cool. Yes, it helps us create financial freedom. Yes, it brings us home to our families. But at the end of the day, every single dollar that you see on the screen, every single dollar that we earn is a direct reflection on the lives that we're impacting. And I feel like that's the best thing about us. We're not selling lipstick to people. We're not, you know, trying to sign people up for, you know, clothes that they don't need or hair products that are over cost. We're trying to change people's lives and make them better mamas, better wives, and just all around better people. And I think that's one of the best things about what we do and, and how we do it. Um, sorry, I'm trying to see who is unmuted. There we go. Uh, but so the major way that you will make an income right now is commission. So we make anywhere between 25 to 40% on commission, just depending on what you're helping somebody with. Um, you all, we also have bonuses. So you'll make anywhere from $14 bonus, um, up to a $40,000 bonus, just depending on where you're at in the company, how many people you've helped, how many people, the people you've helped help and so forth and so forth. And so I really like to talk about, you know, the commission part, because that's really the bulk of where we see our money at the beginning. Um, there's also other bonuses, like if you help five people, the company just like, Hey, you're doing an amazing job. You're helping people. Here's an extra hundred dollars just for being a badass and stuff like that. And so there's amazing income potential here. As you can see, my coach um, is Ashley Molstad and she's actually the number one coach in the network. So she makes an insane amount. And then there's, you know, me and that I've, you know, made a great progression over the last two years. And then some people don't do it as quick. And that's the best thing about this business is you can take it as quickly or as slowly as you want, just depending on the effort that you put in and the energy you put in. And y'all, I'm going to say it like we're not looking for somebody that is just kind of wanting to kind of sort of do it. Like we're looking for somebody that wants to commit, that wants to put in the work, that is willing to not make excuses because this business is only does as much as you put into it. And so if you're willing to work, if you're willing to kind of put your excuses aside, if you're willing to get uncomfortable, get comfortable with feeling uncomfortable, then you're going to be successful. You're going to get to help people. Um, and that's just really what we're looking for as in people, right? So also the best thing about it is you have opportunities to learn, earn all inclusive vacations. So we've gone to places like Punta Cana and the Dominican Republic, that is the Dominican Republic. Um, and then Mexico and California, and there's so many opportunities to travel as long as you're helping people. And all of these are completely paid for just by the amount of lives that you help. And so next year, we're actually going to Riviera Maya. And the way you earn that is simply by doing your job, simply by helping people get started with the full solution package, exactly what you're going to get started with. Um, you can earn spots into test groups, which are freaking amazing and such an awesome opportunity. And you can see like y'all, the best thing about being a part of this company is a part of the community. You can see we aren't just, you know, coaches, right? We're family. And the best thing is like, I am a coach and they're nowhere near part of my team or, you know, we're all just different parts of the network, have different coaches, but we all come together because we love each other and we love the community aspect. There's no competition. We all just want to help each other. And I think that's just one of the biggest blessings that there is with this coaching opportunity is that you just get to meet some of your best friends that love to drink wine and hang out with each other. And so it's really, really just such a freaking blessing. But so that's how we earn money. That's a little bit about vacations. Um, I know a few of them wanted to say something um, about just kind of like, what we're looking for and all that. Liz, do you want to say something, Melissa, Megan? Sure, I won't make it awkward. <laughs> <laughs>
this is what happens when you get a bunch of introverts on a call, y'all. We just, right? just kind of stare at each other. So if, if you're an introvert, I'm telling you, you're going to fit right in. <laughs> Swear. Um, no, just to piggyback off of what Ali was saying, um, there's, there's three different paths that we offer in this company, right? And you might have seen it on the income progression slide. Um, one is the path of the discount coach, which is how we all started. You might've heard some of us mention it and you can sign up with, when you sign up with one of our, what's called a challenge pack, which is our nutrition and our workouts together, which is the complete solution. Your business fee is waived and you then save 25% off of any future orders. Yes. That includes sports bras to my athleisure girls out there. You can get some cute gear for 25% off, but um, that's how a lot of coaches and a lot of us started. That's how I started. Remember, not going to share anything on social media. Um, and then there's the hobby coach, which is somebody who kind of talks about it as they're asked, isn't really looking to like build a business. It's just kind of like getting their feet wet, not really doing the things. We are looking for the girls who are ready to do the damn thing. We are looking for people who are ready to, cause all of us on here are running. We're all running, we're going with this, we're seeing how far this thing can take us. And we have big dreams to be able to take our teams to um, when you know, COVID-19 is under control, but be able to you know, party and have retreats with our teams and go to our annual conferences and take them to dinners and celebrate and do all of those things. But we can't do that by ourselves. We need people around us who are going to run, who are ready to level up. And like Ali said, get comfortable being uncomfortable. That's not to say if you're somebody who's like, I don't know if I can run yet. I might want to start as a hobby. I don't think I can join. That's not to say you're not allowed to sign up. <laughs> it's just saying that we would love for you to get comfortable being uncomfortable. Start running, get your feet wet, at least try it. Because if I had said no, if I had never tried it, I wouldn't be the person I am today. So that's what I have to say about that. <laughs> and I, I, y'all, the thing about this is we're going to give you the resources. We don't, you don't have to know anything. You just have to know that you're willing to learn and you're willing to put in the time you're willing to put in the energy and y'all, it doesn't take a lot of time to be super successful at the beginning. You know, just like Megan said, she fit it in 10 minutes here, 15 minutes here. Any time that we, I literally was able to retire myself on an hour and a half of intentional work. I would send messages on the bathroom breaks and on my lunch breaks at work and all that stuff because, you know, we make time for those things that we find important. And so your coach, whoever you sign up with, will work with you on finding the best schedule for you. We'll give you an amazing training. We'll give you that mentorship that you're, you're seeking and you'll need will help you along the way as long as you're you're putting in the effort and you're showing up and you're doing the work. Because really the, the big goal that we have at the beginning is to help three people. That's our goal at the beginning. To, we're going to give you is to help three people. So one, you can get your enrollment paid for, which I will be going over after this because that's what we want to. We want to make sure this is free basically to get you started up. Um, and then we set goals after that. And so we all know three people. We all know, you know, people that could benefit from this. So we would help you along the way. But I know a lot of us sitting here thinking, you know, that's great for her, but I can't do that. And I want to challenge you, but why not? You know, why couldn't you do that? Maybe because you don't feel as confident right now. I promise you every single one of us had zero confidence at the beginning. I literally did one of these calls my very first time and wrote every single thing of my story out and read it taped it to my screen on my computer and read it verbatim. That's how uncomfortable I was. But I kept doing it and I kept getting better. And that's the exact same thing that will help it happen with you is the best thing is you build confidence and I promise you, you won't be the exact same person that you are today, two years from now, if you do this, because it will make you a better person. It will make you a better mama. It'll make you a better wife. And it, it's just an all around full solution. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen again. We're going to get into how you enroll because I know tons of you guys are so excited to jump in to do this. I know um, we all three, four have mentorships coming up, so it's the best time now. And we will be offering some awesome, you know, promos on this call. So I will talk about that in a second. So 
let me go ahead and share my screen again. So here are your purchase prices to enroll. And so we have a couple different options. Um, and so the first one is the nutrition bundle that is with your superfoods. So you're going to get a year access of our on-demand platform, which you're going to have access to every single one of the workouts that we have available. And I'll actually show you that platform here in a minute. You'll get 30 days of our superfood shake. Um, you'll also get a cool shaker bottle, access to each of our nutrition account or accountability. So you'll get an accountability app to help with you on that, that journey. One-on-one -on -one check ins from your coach. You'll also get that mentorship. So you're going to get training. You're going to get access to weekly team calls. Um, you're also going to get access to an amazing push coach once a month to really be able to help you in that mindset department. Um, and that nutrition bundle is $140 right now. And so this is $20 off from our normal packages. So you're getting an additional discount for joining right now um, because it is normally $160. The second option is our performance bundle. So it doesn't have the superfood shake, which we do highly recommend because that is one of our best products. I, I believe it's even better than the workout sometimes because it did completely change my life and my gut health and really helped me with my, you know, cravings and my sweet tooth and all that stuff. But the second option is with our pre or post workout. The pre-workout is our all natural plant-based workout. Um, it basically is liquid gold. It gives you all the energy. I use it to clean my house. I use it to be a mom. You know, when you know moms try to go out late at night and act like they're young again, I mix it with a little vodka, make a mom a cocktail to give me some energy to make it through the night, you know, all the things. Then you'll also get our post-workout, which is our supplement to help with depleted muscles after your workout and help with soreness. Um, you'll get accountability, access, all that good stuff, same as the beginning. And then the third option is our all-in. This is the one I highly recommend. You'll get our superfood shake as well as our pre and post-workout. And remember, all of these options are $20 off right now. The best thing about enrolling with this is there is a $39.95 fee for becoming a coach. But when you sign up right now with us, that is completely waived. So you don't have to worry about that fee. Um, and then you also get the mentorships, the trainings and all that stuff. Y'all, I just want to say something real quick because a big thing about what I had about, you know, network marketing and all that stuff was, okay, so I'm going to have to invest thousands of dollars on products that I may or may not sell eventually. Cause I always thought of like Lula Rue where you have to buy all these products or Monet or all this stuff. The best thing about what we do is y'all. The only investment you have to make to starting this business is that investment in yourself. You will never be out of money because the only investment you have to make is that investment in you. So there's no fees except for a $15 fee every month, but then you get 25% off on your products. You're in the good. And so it's just an amazing thing because I always say at the end of this, so you're the world's worst coach, right? You suck. You don't try. You don't do anything like this is worst case scenario, right? Like you just, you're awful, but you get in the best shape of your life. That's the worst thing that could happen. And I always say, is that really the worst thing that possibly could happen? Y'all, there is no, there's no downside to doing this. There's no downside to starting because you're only investing in yourself. You're only placing a bet on yourself. And I don't know about y'all, but I would bet on myself 10 times over the, before I bet on anybody else. And, you know, even if at the end of this, it doesn't work out, you're not the coach that you wanted to be, or you just didn't like it. You're not going to be stuck with thousands of dollars of products sitting in your house, wondering how you're going to get rid of them. You're not stuck with debt because you took out a loan to start this business. You have the possibility to create a six, seven figure business all for $140, all for the investment you make in yourself. And I don't know about y'all, but I have heard of a lot of startups and none of them cost that. I was part of State Farm. They would take out six figure loans to, to open up an agency. And if it flopped, they were out that money. And the best thing that you have is y'all, we all have the potential to create financial freedom for ourselves, for our families. We're willing to work for it. 
and we only have to invest in ourselves and the products that we use and consume. So I wanted to go ahead and share, share with you guys the platform of which we get our workouts. So you really can see the value in the workouts that we get and the opportunities that you can have within those. So I'm going to share that real quick and then we're going to wrap this sucker up. So here is what we call Beachbody on Demand. Um, and this is where it's basically called our Netflix of fitness, where you'll be able to access your workouts and your nutrition plans. So here is every single workout that you would ever possibly ever need is right here. And you get access to all of them for an entire year when you enroll. And y'all, this keeps going and keeps going. There's over 1,500 individual workouts um, on here. Pre and postnatal, dancing, boxing, uh, insane, crazy people workouts, hammer and chisel, which is just body lifting. There's pyo, there's yoga, there's pre and postnatal. Every... Thing that anybody would ever want to work out with we have right here in our arsenal and then each of them have their own nutrition plan on there so you can go to the program materials and be able to get to see the nutrition plans get to see all that stuff um, and get to follow it we also have something called bod groups which is where our accountability groups is this is an amazing place for you to be able to track um, your how many workouts you do your nutrition your of uh, your freaking shakes, every single thing like that, and get support and accountability from people that you trust, including our, your coaches. So you're never alone on this journey. And so you get all of that just for that one investment, just for investing in yourself and getting the full solution. I know for me, it, the biggest fear I had was being left, right? Signing up, not having any idea what I'm doing, not knowing what I'm getting. But the best thing about joining one of us is we're here. We're really working and we're really growing amazing teams and our coaches are seeing success. So you're not just joining a team that, you know, doesn't really do anything. You'll be joining one of the up and coming teams. And so that is really what I wanted to share. I didn't know if anybody else wanted to add something before I go over how they can let us know that they're ready to do this. Did anybody else want to share anything? None of our introverts wanted to talk. Okay. Megan, there we oh, go. I was going to say, I think you covered everything perfectly. Oh. So great job, girl. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and share it one more time and see y'all. We're just as awkward as you are. So if you, it's, it is what it is. We're just all pretty awkward humans. And I think that's the best thing is sometimes we do these calls with babies on our laps. Sometimes we do these calls with, you know, toddlers yelling in the background or, you know, technical difficulties. And the best thing about this is we just have to be ourselves. Like that's the best thing about this business is there's no one else we'd rather be but ourselves. So you can go ahead and screenshot this so you know how to let us know that you're ready to um, enroll. But the first thing, if you're ready, you're like, I know I'm ready to do this, you will email the coach that invited you. So you can either email or direct message however you've been contacting that coach. Um, and then do the subject heading, I'm in. So we know that you're in and you go first priority because we will only be taking a select amount and only a select amount of people will be getting those discounts and some little fun free gifts. So we want to make sure that we give y'all the ones that are on this call top priority on that. The third thing you'll want to put in that message is your legal first and last name, um, as well as which pa package option you would like. So you can go ahead and take a picture of this if you want to real quick. Um, you'll just say nutrition bundle, performance bundle, or nutrition and performance. So we know which one you want to sign up with. Um, then you will do what flavor of the superfoods you would like. We do have chocolate, vanilla, strawberry, cafe latte, um, and then vegan of all those. And then, oh, it's right there. So you'll let us know that, and then we will send you over a link to enroll. You want to make sure that you get that link completed as quick soon as possible, because when the only time your spot is actually saved in our mentorships is when you complete that link. So you want to make sure that you do get that done in a timely manner so we don't give away your spot to somebody else. Um, and then once you do complete that, then your mentorship will start. Then we'll go ahead and get you sent over your welcome emails, get you into our training, and then we'll start doing that one-on-one -on -one coach mentorship that we spoke on. So that is all I have. I want to thank every single one of you guys for hanging out with us. 
for taking time out on your Monday evening. I hope every single one of y'all have a taco in your future for tomorrow, Cinco de Mayo. I know I have a margarita and a taco in my future. Um, I really wish I could actually go to Mexican, but you know, quarantine life. But I will, mine, mine is actually doing takeout, so I get to do takeout margaritas. It's the next best thing. So I am so proud of y'all for sticking through. I cannot wait to welcome every single one of y'all to our teams um, and just celebrate all the lives that are about to be changed. All right, bye y'all. You guys have a great night.